So these are the tri-board fingerless gloves. I had a discussion with Thijs about the best uh, gloves for cycling. And uh, he wanted just gloves uh, with two uh, uh, questions. The first one without uh, the fingertop, so like this. But the second one was that he wanted warm uh, palms from his hands, so not the very modern, very sleek and light uh, gloves, but like the longer gloves. And some people would call them the time trial bike gloves, of the triathlete gloves, because they're very aerodynamical. So then we had a discussion about this feature, because if you saw the other videos, I do not really like this thing because I think it's kind of useless because if this is uh, elastic like this is then you don't really need this this is like yeah it's all stuff you pay for it and you don't use it really and yeah it bothers me because if the rest is so sleek then this is just a little strange and you see more and more gloves for cycling which do not have like something here like the, the strap, how do you call it? The, in Holland we call it the glitterband. You don't really need this. But for the rest I think it's okay and the price is really good from Tribord. Because it's, I think was 15, uh, 15 bucks. So that's really good. So I can't really complain about it because like Castelli gloves or um, Assos gloves are like the double in price. And sometimes uh, they are like, like 40 or 50 uh, so these are just 15, um, they do not really have like padding, just a double uh, stitching, double material, that's yeah, uh, it, it won't last for me personally if I go cycling for like 6 hours, then I want like real padding and also here, but if you just cycle like 1 hour it's, it's great and that's for Thijs uh, perfect, so different demands for different cyclists, so just wanted to show you them. Um, I use them because we have two pairs of them, but I wanted to show you the new ones, which, which are like just brand new. What they do, do not have is like a stuff here that you can just pull them out very easily. So if you want to put them out, you will get like uh, this. And then when you want to go cycling, you have to just take some time, just make them like this. Perhaps you recognize it. That's always a little bit bothering to me because if I want to go sporting, I want to ju just go right now. But that's just my opinion. And of course, if there's a little piece in between here, that's also weight and you don't want to wait on your bike. Especially if you go like road biking. So that's my opinion on those tri gloves. But also in on gloves in, yeah, uh, regular but what do we need to take uh, attention to in my opinion thanks for watching hope you liked it and rate it with a little thump